Hi guys, it's Owen Lacey here from the ISI. Today we want to follow on from our last video about full range of motion. Today we're going to talk about full range of motion of an exercise. We have John here going to perform a wide grip bench press for us. Go ahead, John. I'm back in. Now, we don't advocate necessarily wide grip bench presses, but the point of this uh, demonstration is to show you that when you take a wide grip or a close grip or a mid grip, it emphasizes different muscles in a different way. So when you know what the prime mover is, in this case the pectoralis major, the secondary muscles, triceps, antagonists, fixators, and neutralizers. By knowing what's involved and what muscles are involved in that exercise, you know that when you put a second program in place, you have to offset the imbalance caused from that exercise. Now, the problem is we find when people pick an exercise like a bench press, they will change their grip, they will change their tempo, they will change where they put it on the chest. So in order for you to keep injury free, it's important that your next program de-emphasize the muscles that you just worked on, offset the muscular imbalance, and address the weaknesses in the synergists, stabilizers, and fixators. Stay tuned for part three.